Hey everyone, welcome or welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Ari. I'm a Taurus Sun, Cancer Rising, Aquarius Moon, and a Life Path number seven. Also, Pisces Venus. If you're not new here, thank you for watching another video of mine and choosing to support me further. It does mean a lot to me. Please make sure to like, comment, and subscribe before you do leave this video, especially if you're able to relate or connect with this reading. So today, everyone, I'm here with a journal love tarot reading for all of my Pisces who are watching. So if you have Pisces as your sun, moon, rising, Venus, or anywhere in your chart, this reading might resonate or apply to you. So Pisces, this will be a journal love tarot reading. I will be channeling any energy in regards to love that is coming towards you. This energy might be surrounding you at this moment currently but before I do go ahead and get started with your reading Pisces please keep in mind that this will be a general reading for the sign of Pisces so it may not resonate or relate to you specifically and if it does not please don't take it personally all right Pisces so without further ado let's go ahead and check in on the energy that we have coming towards you in regards to love Who's this person coming towards Pisces, please, in regards to love? And what energy are they bringing with them towards Pisces? King of Pentacles to start out with. Let's go ahead and get a few more cards for Pisces, please. We have our second card, Will of Fortune. Can we please get a few more cards for Pisces? Regarding the King of Pentacles and the Will of Fortune. The Hanged One. So we have King of Pentacles, Will of Fortune, the Hanged One. Let's go ahead and get one more card, please, for now, for Pisces. Regarding the King of Pentacles, Will of Fortune, and the Hanged One. Five of Wands. We'll actually get one more card for Pisces. What other energy is this person bringing towards Pisces? See what we have, the devil. So to start out, Pisces, we have the King of Pentacles, Will of Fortune, the Hanged One. We also have the Five of Wands and the devil. So Pisces, um, I feel like this person coming towards you or that you're dealing with currently i feel like you would like to see what happens with this person over time um instead of maybe just jumping into something with them right away um i feel like this person wants to offer you love security stability it's like they're maybe already settled into their life their lifestyle this might also be a person who is older they knew Pisces and they're ready to go forward with you but I feel like you Pisces you might be observing this person maybe there are some things that you've taken in for yourself and it makes you a little bit weary of just jumping into something with this person I feel like you're you're taking things by the flow and that doesn't mean you're maybe dismissing this person's gestures and their their offers towards you but i feel like with you pisces you don't want to jump into anything too soon um this person i feel like and please keep in mind roles energy feelings emotions or actions they could be reversed but i feel like with this person pisces maybe you think or feel as though you have less freedom being with them and it, it's like this person might impose on your alone time or just the time you need for yourself and to explore other avenues for yourself, Pisces. Um, this person could just be too overbearing towards you, always wanting to be by your side or be right next to you. So, of course, if this resonates with you that could affect us like this person being clingy or very en enthusiastic about getting to know us to the point where they give us attention 24 7 that might be or feel good to you Pisces but it might scare you off a bit so we have the king of Pentacles I feel like this is this person's energy um, 
they're not hiding the fact that they could supply things for this connection or take care of you or start something firm and solid with you Pisces and I feel like they're showing that they're able to do that by their actions and how they're maybe courting you setting this connection up maybe there has been talks of bigger plans together this person although we have the king of pentacles and pentacles is earth and earth is slow moving maybe they are going a bit too fast for you pisces we have the will of fortune for some of my pisces out there maybe this will only resonate for some but you're not used to this attention or you're not used to a person being so straightforward so you might think like this is too good to be true or there's a catch but for some of my pisces out there you might be in your head and taking on the energy of the hanged one just observing this person letting things go with the flow and or go by the flow and not really imposing just yet but maybe this will be better than you you think pisces taking a chance with this person um if you do resonate with the feeling like not feeling or being treated like this by a person before pisces I feel like you already have this idea like there's a catch, something will go wrong, or in this case with the will of fortune reversed, it's like things are bound to resonate with my doubts and my fears. So that might resonate for some of my Pisces out there. This person does want you though, um, and that's why they're not hiding or backing away from how they feel towards you and how they want to involve you in their life. It might be a little bit smothering or overbearing. Um, and for my Pisces who have their guard up, you might be able to see through this person or know exactly where they want to take you. And that's, that's not something that you're comfortable with. And that's why you don't want to jump into anything with them too prematurely. We do have the devil that came out. Maybe you feel like this is leading you down the wrong road or just being with this person or by what you observe about them so far is not something that you want for yourself long term but I feel like this is your person's energy in the way that they want you Pisces and they're not they're not shying away from that five of wands this person might feel like they're in competition with other people really fighting for your attention um, fighting to be seen you could be dealing with the fire sign Pisces. We do have Leo, Taurus, Scorpio, Aquarius, and also some Capricorn energy. Let's go ahead and get a few more cards for Pisces. Let's see what we have. Two cards came out. We have Six of Pentacles and the Sun. We'll go ahead and keep both of those cards. Can we please get a few more cards for Pisces? Three of Wands. let's go ahead and get okay Pisces that card came out easily we have the nine of wands I'm gonna go ahead and put that back let's go ahead and get a few more specific cards for Pisces please regarding this energy what else does Pisces need to know about the six of Pentacles the Sun and the three of wands the Emperor let's go ahead and get one more card please for Pisces see what we have we have the moon card bottom of the deck we have six of swords seven of wands ace of swords knight of pentacles so pisces last few cards we have six of pentacles the sun three of wands the emperor and then we also have the moon so pisces all in all with the energy that we have all together i feel like this person they're going to prove to be there for you they're going to prove to have everything that they feel you can necessarily want or need they're going to fulfill they're going to try to fulfill your needs and wants by providing to you giving you their time their attention their resources giving you somebody that 
you can really rely on and trust. And I feel like this person is going to try to appeal to you and make you happy. But in the end, it's up to you, Pisces, because I feel like there's maybe some difference here, something that you're not too fond of. Um, and this might be something bigger, make or break type of thing. It could be you saying that you could have love for this person, but there's other characteristics or traits about them that you can't get over. And you know, if you let it slide or get get over or ignore it now, then in the end it'll create a problem or just something that would be better to avoid. So this person is showing themselves to you like I could take care of you, I could provide, I could give to you. Being that loyal partner and I feel like this person, they might make you happy Pisces. They want to give you everything under the sun. They're trying to appeal to you so that you could be with them. But there might be someone else on your mind Pisces. Um, however this energy resonates with you but we have the three of wands I feel like you're still not having your full attention or focus on this person looking elsewhere like there's something on your mind that you, you might have more passion for or someone you might have more passion and love for and in the end Pisces you're going to do what's right for yourself you're going to listen to your emotions because this type of decision you might think about it every single day if you do not make the right decision for yourself so you know it's that important so you're going to listen to your heart your mind your soul your intuition here and i feel like your emotions might already be telling you the answer and the emperor pisces you're going to go towards what you want to go towards i feel like you try to leave this person's feelings and emotions out of it because in the end you might realize it's what you want only that's all that matters so i feel like you're going to make a serious decision on whether they're whether to be with this person or whether not to be let's see what sign you might be dealing with can we please get a sign for pisces sun moon rising venus pisces came out scorpio can we please get a sign for pisces what sign is relevant please sagittarius Let's go ahead and get one more sign for Pisces, please. And Taurus. We'll get one more sign for Pisces, please. Taurus again. And Leo came out. All right, Pisces, I'm going to go ahead and leave it at that for today. As always, I appreciate the love and support. Please like, comment, and subscribe, and I will talk to you next time. Bye.